All right, so we got a new most feared beast event out. And this time it's 99 Gronk. Of course, he's seven foot nine like Marshawn Lynch. Whenever they dropped that on Marshawn Lynch, it was amazing. Look at this catching traffic, 101 on that. Only 90 speed. And he is a monster. You can see him here on the solo challenge. Look at that. Seven foot nine makes dwarves everybody else. I would argue Gronk actually looks at that in real life. But here was the big news of today. We got a limited edition Dez Bryant. 91 speed, 93 elusiveness, 98 spec catch, 96 regular catch, 97 jump, 88 release, 90 route running, 95 catch in traffic. This was the cheapest one at 950,000 coins. He looks amazing. And to think that this guy is still gonna go to 99 overall next weekend, this weekend. So here you see the rest of the stats, an amazing card. He's not gonna run block at all. That 55 run block is horrible, but he has really good run after the catch stats all in the 90s. The spec catch is 98 is amazing. I'm gonna do what I can do to go get this card and try him out for you guys. And just to let you guys know, a little channel update. I'm just gonna be reviewing all the cards that you guys are gonna wanna see from now on. I've been building up the coins so that we can make sure that we do that for you. But let's try to go get this Dez Bryant. Let's see if we can get him. I'm not going to rip open any more of those most feared packs. I think that's pointless. I'm going to give you 15 pro packs right here. Let's jump right into them because I think 15 pro packs right now is a better bet. And right out of the gate, we get another pro pack. So they're multiplying right here. Let's go ahead and add that onto the set so we can have it right after this pack opening. But what I'm doing with all these cards is the reason why I want the pro packs. I'm spending all the time of throwing these cards into those sets, which is what you should be doing. And there we go. We get another DeAndre Hopkins. I still haven't shown you gameplay video with this football outside of DeAndre Hopkins. So we're going to go ahead and sell that one since we have the other one on the squad. Too much content has been coming out right now. But like I was saying, all of the other cards that we're getting in these packs are gonna go into i believe it's the vault sets those are gonna give us badges which in turn are gonna allow me to get some of these flashback pools that i want to do for you guys i think later on in the week on friday we're gonna do a flashback friday flashback pack open but anyway so far we really have nothing we're going through these packs and let me tell you one of the things that i've been noticing about this promo is that I really like those cool solo challenges that they're doing. I've been talking a lot of trash about the promo. A lot of you have shared my sentiment about this promo. Um, I've just been making money off of it. As you can see, each and every video, my coin total is going up and up and up and up and up. I did sell that Megatron because I want to make sure I have enough coins to go out and scoop those cards that you guys are asking about in the comment section below. Make sure that you give me some idea of what players you want to see in the player reviews. Those player review videos that I do have traditionally been my highest viewed videos next to some of my bigger pack openings. But to be honest with you, on average, those gameplay videos that you guys are seeing are always some of the biggest ones. Anyway, speaking of biggest ones, this so far is not one of my biggest pack openings, but we're going to keep doing it. Since pro packs are a little cheaper, I'm going to make sure I keep ripping open, uh, ripping these packs open for you guys so you guys can see them. So some of the ideas that I have for this week, I think a lot, you know, this week was a great team of the week week. I'm going to try out some of those cards. I think that 87 Lamar Miller looks pretty good because he's not as expensive as maybe some of the other cards. Of course, we got to go out and cop that limited edition Mike Evans. Since I did try out that Megatron, how does that 90 overall Mike Evans stack up against him? Is he just as good? Are we gonna be getting some of those circus catches? You know, the DRC, it's harder to try out because yes, we can try out that DRC and see how he goes against other teams. But the problem is you don't have as many beast teams out there. So if the DRC is going out there and feasting on some of these weak teams you guys have been seeing me play, it may not be as entertaining. Or is it? Let me know in the comment section below. I wanna try out that Lamar Miller because because of that speed, I think it's really, really awesome. The other thing I wanna discuss with you, I don't know if you've seen it or not, but this Saturday, we're gonna end up getting a legend Walter Payton and a legend Sterling Sharp. Now you've always seen the legend Shannon Sharps, but let me tell you, Sterling Sharp was a beast receiver back in the day. He's one of the main reasons why Brett Favre was able to make such a huge splash 
onto the league whenever he came out because he had a dominant receiver in Sterling Sharp. Sterling Sharp went on to be a pretty good ESPN analyst. However, Sterling Sharp had some neck problems that really cut his career short, but he was great. He was fast. He could pretty much catch everything. He could run all the routes. So I'm really excited about those two perspective legends coming out. You guys know I'm always excited about Walter Payton because I would consider myself a running back head. Now this pack opening right here is gonna be the last of the 15 pro packs that you saw me open up. After this pack, we're gonna go ahead and redeem that last pro pack that we had and let's see what we can get out of that one. So, so far not much. Most of these are gonna go either into their respective captain sets that I'm completing at the moment, or they're gonna go into those vault sets like I talked about. So unfortunately we weren't able to get that Des Bryant, but that Des Bryant 93 overall, a little too expensive for me right now. I'm gonna to try to get him for you by the end of the week. Maybe I'll try him out whenever he's 99 overall. I don't know if his price is gonna go down to be honest with you, because of the fact that he's gonna to go to 99 overall at the end of the week. So anyway, make sure in the comment section below, you're giving me ideas on what players you wanna see. Like if you like this Des Bryant card, Subscribe if you're new to get some more of that content every day, but most importantly, take care of yourself. Peace. They're on second and 10. I said, you know what? Let's just bomb and deep and get the hell out of here. Are you serious? Are you serious? All right, so there's a lot of cars that we've talked to you guys about that are in packs or we have the possibility to get the cars that came in their set in packs. So we're gonna go ahead and open up a couple of packs for you.